All right, so what I want to explain is how to tie the racking to the wall to keep it nice and sturdy and, and safe in its location. What I've done up here is I've found a stub location throughout the wall that works kind of in between a column of racking. I've drilled a hole through my back spacer bar to meet that stud location and then taken a four inch wall screw that we do not provide and drilled into the stud with it. And what that has done is that has secured this whole rack to the wall. Alright, so previously I was discussing on how to tie an individual rack to the wall. Now I want to discuss at how many locations throughout the system of racking you may need to do this in your wine cellar. On this particular application, I've done it two places on this wall and two places on this wall. And this is all you really need to do for your cellar. So on this L, I've done it in four locations. And the reason this is the only, the only places you need to do it is because every one of these racks and every one of these units are all tied together with screws. The racking itself is tied to the casework through screws underneath the upper, underneath the space of ours into the casework. And then on my diamond bin here, I put screws through the diamond bin into the four bottle cubby behind the face frame of the diamond bin. On the conversion boxes up here, I put a screw behind the wing plate location into the four bottle cubby. And if you go through your whole cellar and do this, you don't have to worry about any of these units shifting on each other or anything like that. And everything's secured well to the wall and you just don't have to worry about it.